Hey, peoples. <laughs> I know, I'm back. Um, second video blog of the morning. You know, I'm catching up because I hadn't blogged in like uh, a month. And, um, we're going to call this one another Sapphire Says video. Um, we're going to call this one Call Me Low Dage Loaf. <laughs> You know why? <laughs> Cause my song by Dages been on my grind all week. I ain't been getting no sleep, but that shit don't matter to me. My mama said it should matter to me. She said your health is everything. Let me tell you something. I know that my health come first, but I've been on my fucking grind all week. I don't sleep. I be chilling. Like, when I do sleep, I sleep on some weird shit. I might go to bed at 5 o'clock in the afternoon. I don't give a fuck. I get in bed, it's 5.30. I'm like, uh -huh. I'm on Facebook. I'm in bed for the night, holla at me tomorrow. I don't care. I don't care. Because it's 8 o'clock. I've been up for four and a half hours already. And when y'all people wake up in the morning, I had already been grinding. The grind don't stop because you sleep. You hear me? That's when people like me get the fuck up and get to work. Then, <laughs> then 2, 3 o'clock in the afternoon, you be like, mm, I'm so tired, lunch break. I be like, shh. Tired lunch break. I'm cooking dinner. <laughs> Day over. <laughs> I grind, you know. I grind, so it's cool, you know, to to worry about your health and all the other things that's supposed to be important. But you know, when you in grind mode, <laughs> and I'm in grind mode lately, you know. <laughs> I've been on my grind, you know, I'm chilling. So anyway. <laughs> anyway. I, I'm in such a peaceful mood this morning. And that's good. Because my last couple days been like. <laughs> <laughs> but this morning I'm in a peaceful mood. And, and we're not going to let none of that <clears throat> come over here today. We, we good today. We good. Good. <laughs> so anyway. This morning, you know, I just did a video blog about uh, my new business I'm starting, Stronger Than My Struggles. Um, I also want to talk about some of the other things that I've had going on in the last month. You know, it's a lot more than, oh, I'm starting this new website. Oh, I'm a motivational speaker now. Like, no, there are all kinds of stuff going on, you know. And um, I got to fill y'all in. So... You know I've run um, Sapphire Spotlight on Talent. I don't really talk about it much on my videos or anything. Like, I never talk about my, my talent promo company. Uh, but, it's time to start advertising a little differently. So anyway, um, for the last two years, I've been running Sapphire Spotlight on Talent.com. Um, it's a talent promotion and resource company. I like to highlight uh, artistic talents and creative people who might not get the attention that they should because a lot of folks uh, focus on people who already got way too much attention, you know, and I feel like uh, people who are mainstream and uh, already doing big things get enough attention. So I started a site for people who are aspiring, aspiring um, up and coming and trying to get the big notice and it's not for you know like people who started yesterday but it's for people who started like in the last year to five years and haven't reached to where they want to be you know um i've been doing really well with different sections on the site the site's been up for two years i've gotten to the point where i can actually charge some people to be on the site now which is really cool because that's me mean, that means progress um, I remember when I used to, to chase people around and beg them to be on my site, you know, it's, it's kind of cool. And so, one of my favorite sections of the site is my model of the month category. I try to pick very diverse and, um, influential models who have something going for themselves other than their look, you know, even though that's what's important. I really like to find people who have a story and something to share other than look at me, you know? 
And so uh, I booked the model of the month up until July or August already. And I only had like four slots open for the rest of the year, which is really cool because it's only March. So um, I got like four spots left. They're free interviews. It's, it's, if you can get me your bio, three to five pictures, and um, all your social media links to sapphiretosexyone.com. I got four spots open. When they gone, they gone. Um, so, um, besides the model of the month category, I have feature interviews, which are for people who are actually making real moves in the industry. Like, if I you see their name, you might recognize it, or you've seen them on TV, heard them on the radio regularly. Like, these people all have some really good, uh, credible things going on. Um, if I approach you for a feature interview... It's free. If people approach me for a feature interview, it's $60. I'm economical. Um, I have another section on the site where I do interviews with up-and-coming talent who might not um, fit the criteria to be in the feature section. Again, if I approach you, it's free. If you approach me, it's $30. You know, I want everybody to win, so I make it affordable for everybody. We also advertise, uh, offer advertisements. You can use sidebar. You can do text ads. You can um, get an affiliate page built in for only $75. That way, people will see your page on the site. Um, if you don't have a website, this is a really good opportunity for you. Like, say, you're a singer, artist, whatever. Um, you don't want to spend the money to build your own site, have to run your own site, that kind of thing. But you want to be able to advertise and sell your products through other people's sites. It's cool. You set up an affiliate page with me. Um, it would look just like your site. Your name would be there. People would come. They would see all your content, your advertisements. You can put a PayPal button on there. People can buy directly from my site, get your stuff, whatever. Holler at me again. It's sapphiresexyone.com. Um we take talent of all type. This is my latest flyer. You might have seen my online flyer, but this is a new one. And we take talent of all type, you know. And on the back, it says, Sapphire Spotlight on Talent only features the hottest in indie entertainment. Check out our feature interviews, model of the month, resource area, and more. Promo blast, social media marketing, blog placement, interviews, and web design available. Invest in yourself and get featured. I'll let your girl, you know. And... Ah, see, I got a bonus for y'all. I'm syndicated now. Uh, a lot of what I uh, post and people who I interview can now be syndicated onto um, Urban Legend Media, which is a blog based out of Las Vegas. So, holla at me, get your feature, end up on two sites. <laughs> and um, besides running my talent promo biz, and working on my new business for the motivational speaking i've been writing you know i'm always writing i still work for the urban twist i have over 200 articles for them i'm really pumped about um one of my interviews last week i actually interviewed the the woman who created the lego women of nasa playset for lego right i know y'all saw it like at the hidden figures came out it was such a big thing it was so cool to see that lego was releasing uh the women of nasa playset and that one of the women was actually katherine johnson who was depicted in the movie so that was so cool so i thought oh i'm interested i'm gonna write an article about it so i did so i write an article about the women of nasa through lego and about a week later, I noticed radio stations was sharing my article. Well, one of the radio stations who shared my article reached the woman who created the Women of NASA uh, playset for Lego. And her name is Maya Weinstock. And so she thanked me for writing the article on her creation. And you know me, I'm like, mm. hi. Oh, that's so awesome. I, this is really your creation? Can I interview you? She said, yes. I mean, it was that simple. All I did was ask. She said yes. <laughs> it's so many people who don't get that dream because they're afraid to even ask a question. Like this woman, Maya Weinstock, she's so smart. Like not only did she create Lego Women of NASA playset, but she's the deputy editor of the MIT Review. Yeah, MIT. The Yeah, 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 you heard me. That's cool. Yeah, yeah. Like, this woman 
has created toys and and brain games that you probably have bought for your kids while working for companies like Brain Pop. You know, uh, she worked for Space and Discover. Like, she's amazing. And I just said, can I interview you? And she said, yes. So <laughs> the interview is online and syndicated in three places because it's on my site under feature interviews and it's on the urban twist and it's on urban legend media in vegas so again you should holler at your girl because if i like you i like you and if you're popular and talented i'm gonna want to interview interview you and i kind of get some good promo <laughs> and um I've teamed up recently to start booking talent for a, a radio show here in Baltimore. So, again, you, you want to come and holler at me for Sapphire Spotlight on Talent.com. I, I, I got some stuff going on for y'all. You know, don't be afraid to holler at your girl. I'm really easy to talk to. Yeah. I'm all over the internet. You can find me anywhere. And I'll be out uh, this, Sat this Sunday. I'll be at the DMA, uh, which is the DMV Media Alliance, hosted by Raven Paris. I'll be there. I'll be in VIP. You know, come see me. Come get some business cards and some flyers. Give me your card. Introduce yourself. You know, let me know who you be so we can network. Mm, all right? Come holler at your girl. And remember, sapphirespotlightontalent.com. And businesses, if you got something to offer... Hit me up. I got a resource area. It need to be filled up. Get in there. $10. Get your business listed. Holla at your girl. Mwah. <laughs>